nothing if I can't have you. I can't write one song that's not about you. Hi guys, it's Christy and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I wanted to switch things up again, so I secret shopped famous Instagram slime shops. I mean, not that any of them even probably know who I am. But I disguised my name and ordered from them to see how the packages would arrive. So we're going to be unboxing them and reviewing them today. And if you guys haven't entered my second back to school giveaway, make sure you guys click the link in the description box below and go to the video to find all the rules on how to enter. It's still open. There's so many awesome prizes and you will not want to miss out. And for today's post notification shout out, there are four of you guys. And the first one goes out to... Galaxy Panda 44, Jack Games, Star Skies, and Queen Rear Johnson. Thank you guys so much for having your post notifications on. And if you guys want to get shouted out in my next video, make sure you click the little bell after you subscribe and comment down, down below when you've done that. I'm going to keep this intro nice and short for you guys, so let's just get right into the slime reviews. Woo! The first famous Instagram slime count we have here is Slime King. The slime itself was not bubble wrapped, but there were some packing peanuts included in the package, which was good. They included a slime care sheet and a packet of borax. They did not include any extras, which I don't personally mind, but I just wanted to let you guys be aware of that. So I ordered a six ounce of neon cotton candy for $7.49. I think this may have been on sale. But with shipping, my total came to $13.74, which is such a great price for a six ounce slime. I really can't remember if it was on sale or not, but it's such a good deal. The package took a little over a week to arrive, which wasn't too bad. In their listing, the slime is a neon purple, blue, and pink color. And I noticed that the slime didn't really mix too much because when I took the slime out of the container, you could definitely see all three colors were there. I just love how bright and colorful this slime is, and it is a butter slime, y'all. My favorite. The colors mixed pretty quickly, but it turns into this pretty purple color after they were all mixed. I'm playing with the slime right now, and it has such a smooth and creamy texture. It's also scented with a strong cotton candy scent, which smells amazing. So overall, the price was incredible and the slime was great too. I definitely recommend their shop. And the next famous slime shop is Slime Obsidian. Their slime was nicely bubble wrapped and they included an extras baggie with an airhead, care sheet, and a packet of borax. I've ordered a few times from Slime Obsidian and this is the typical extras baggie you get. So I ordered an eight ounce of mango lychee boba jelly. Sorry if I said it wrong. Is it lychee, lychee, correct me. But this was $13.99. With shipping, my total came to $18.98 which is a little bit pricey, but their containers are such high quality, which I love. They also have a super fast shipping because I got my slime in four days, which is incredible. The slime was filled all the way to the top of the container and it is such a thick jelly slime. I really love the texture and it wasn't sticky at all. It was perfect right out of the container, which is amazing for a jelly slime. There were also clear plastic boba pieces in here, which added a really nice touch to it. The more I kept playing with the slime, the lighter it got in color, which is pretty typical with clearer jelly slime textures, but once it settles, it'll go back to its original color. The scent is exactly what you would expect. It literally smells like mango and lychee mixed. It smells delicious. Overall, I really like this slime and I definitely recommend it and their shop. Moving on, we have Blushing BB Slimes. The slime came nicely bowl wrapped with their business card, borax, and candy. I ordered a six ounce of Penelope the Pineapple Cloud. I paid $14.75 for this slime. With shipping, my total came to $19.73, which I would say is a little bit pricey. 
However, the aesthetic of this slime is everything. The colors are so vibrant and you can definitely tell they spent some time putting this slime together. I'm really not a huge fan of these deli containers though, so I feel like the price isn't 100% justified. But anyways, I had a lot of fun mixing this one together. The pink and yellow are just so vibrant and they look so perfect together. And eventually after I kept mixing it and mixing it, it turned into a bright neon coral color, which was so pretty. This slime has a very nice pineapple scent to it. It also had very little snow fallout for a cloud slime, but I thought the texture felt a little bit on the dense slash stiff side. I've purchased their cloud slimes before and I remember them being very drizzly so this may have just been a bad batch, but it took some effort to stretch and fluff up. I almost felt like the slime was going to rip apart when I stretched it at certain points if that makes any sense. It also wasn't very drizzly, I think they may have just added a little bit too much snow. It wasn't my favorite cloud slime texture unfortunately, but I still loved everything else about it. Next up, we have my first ever slime purchase from Audi Slimes. This slime did not come bubble wrapped, but there was no damage to the slime itself. They included their business card and a packet of borax. I was a little bit surprised they didn't include any extras. Obviously, I don't mind, but I just wanted to inform you guys if you plan on purchasing. Their logo is so pretty. I've never seen a slime logo this large. It almost looks like a decal. I ordered an eight ounce of This Is Patrick, which was $15. With shipping, my total came to $21.91. This slime arrived in about a week too, which isn't too bad. Her shop sold out pretty quick, so I had other slimes in my cart, but they kept selling out, so I chose this one since it was left in stock. This is a super thick, glossy pink slime that came with a star charm. It had a sour candy scent to it, which I really liked. This slime had some really great bubble pops and it was good for poking. I also liked how thick and holdable it was. However, I feel like this slime was definitely overpriced. $15 for an eight ounce slime just seems really high to me and there weren't any add-ins and there wasn't really anything unique about this slime. It also didn't come with any extras. I could see a $15 for a DIY clay slime, but for what I got, even though it was a great slime and I loved it, this just seemed a little bit overpriced to me, but let me know your thoughts below. Lastly, we have a package from Scented Slime by Amy. I love her metallic bubble mailers. Inside my package, she included her business card, borax, a cute sticker, and a piece of candy. I purchased from Amy quite a few times, and I love how she includes the same tissue paper in her packages. It's so cute. This slime also came nicely in bubble wrapped. I ordered a six ounce of Glow Snow Fizz. This slime was $11. With shipping, my total came to $17.67. This slime arrived in five days, which was really fast shipping. The colors in this slime are unreal, and I love the glitters that came on top. There are neon orange, purple, yellow, and pink parts to this slime, which are all so pretty and vibrant. The slime was a little bit sticky at first, but I didn't want to add any activator because snow fizzes can get pretty overactivated. So I just kept mixing the slime together and it eventually turned into such a perfect snow fizz slime texture. I can't really tell what this slime smells like, but it has a fresh clean scent to it, which I really liked. Do you guys hear the crunches and sizzles in this slime? They are amazing. It turns into a pretty magenta color when everything is mixed together. I really love this one a lot.
And that's all that I have for you guys this week. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel and watching this video. Let me know if you guys want to see an I Secret Shop Etsy slime shops or if you guys have more Instagram slime shops that you guys want me to purchase from. And I also have some good news for you guys. A lot of you have been wanting to send me slime packages to review. I'm going to be doing another Famous versus Underrated slime shop review. So if you're interested in sending a slime package, definitely check out the description box below. I'll leave all the information down there if you are interested in sending a package for review. So make sure you guys check that out. There's so many more fun slime videos coming for you guys. So if you're not part of the K-Squad already, join the fam, subscribe, and turn your post notifications on so you get notified every time I upload. Thank you guys so much for watching to the end of the video. I love you all so, so much, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!